hey guys welcome to my channel so I'm here at the thrift store right now it is Friday at 6 45 I'm just going to go thrifting for an hour see what I can find with an hour usually I take like three to four hours so this is gonna kind of be a challenge for me I'm only gonna stay here for an hour because I'm supposed to go out with my sister-in-law tonight at 8 so it's 6.45, so I kind of have an hour, give or take, but I kind of need all the time I could get when I'm in the thrift store, especially because I haven't been here in a while. So everything is like completely probably new to me. So I will want to like check out the racks like in depth. We'll see if I find anything good. I got my bag and I got my camera and my phone and we will get to see what I can find in the thrift store today. Let me also, I think I already added my extra cameras because my batteries always die. So I got that and yeah, let's go ahead and go in. So I always kind of like to check out the furniture area to see if they have anything good. Today is not the day for furniture, so let's move on. Okay, so the fitting rooms are closed, but I'm going to change. This is cute. So awkward having to change outside. Hey guys, so it was pretty stressful considering that I had to, um, well you guys saw a little bit, I had to freaking change inside the store by like the fitting rooms because they didn't let me go into the fitting rooms even though I was waiting prior to the fitting rooms closing, but you know what, you can't even see my eyes, but you know what, it's fine, I still got my bag and now I am going to get ready and go out tomorrow I'm gonna do 
I'm gonna record what I got because it was just really hard to record and show you guys what I was getting and I was already all stressed out sweaty it was hot in there and I just wasn't feeling the vibes you know odds were against me and you know what still thrived so now it is Wednesday so I'm back home I got my big bag got my big bag so the first thing that I actually purchased is what I'm wearing right now it's just a plaid silky PJ shirt and it's like I tied it so it's really cute and it was two dollars and ninety nine cents and then um, 20 percent 30 percent off so it was like a dollar fifty so yeah it was this shirt and it's super cute just a pair with jeans and tie it up and it's it's super flowy so I, I like it it's really cool the next thing that I got just digging in is it was hard to see if I truly really liked things because of the whole fitting room fiasco and situation it was kind of a mess so the way that I tried it on was kind of just out in public so I really didn't get a good try on but yeah so we'll see how I could dress this up this was a pricier item it was $9.99 so I, I just yeah let's hope it works out because I'm not quite sure let's just see and cross our fingers but I think I could I think I could figure out how to wear this even with just like a turtleneck and some boots like that would look really cute so yeah I'm gonna just give this a go and see how I can style it and hopefully I'll style it really well and it was worth the nine ten dollars <laughs> okay so the next thing that I found was this um, orange H&M sweater it's like a really big bright orange sweater I love it because it is so bright I'm I'm very skeptical on bright things I really like black white like the traditional neutrals and stuff like that so going to a bright ass orange it was very I'm really stepping outside of my comfort zone so yeah I I liked it a lot when I tried it on it was like really fitting well and but yeah I thought it was really nice um and it was $3.99 so not bad really like brightening so yeah I like it a lot really really cute I will pair it with some mom jeans so the next thing that I found was these vintage guess jeans and they were $6.99 I got them from the men's section um and they're size 32 34 I think they were a little too tight on me but then again I'm not sure just because of the whole fitting room situation they look like they would fit I mean yeah the waist fit but it may be the butt that doesn't fit so we will go ahead and see it was $6.99 just black and hopefully it looks nice so the next thing that I purchased was this cheetah skirt from doesn't say but it's just this cheetah um, or leopard leopard um, skirt and it kind of flares out at the bottom it was $2.99 I thought oh my gosh it's gonna look so cute with like a just a band tee tied up um, so and it fit perfectly so see on the try on footage how well it looks on um, it just makes my body look so good so I'm really happy about that and it was cheap so that was really cool the next thing that I purchased was this stretch right white stag um, obviously vintage um, tank top and it's just like a rainbow 
it's just like a rainbow and it it's a turtleneck but not quite a turtleneck and I thought it would be really cute for the springtime or the summertime with mom jeans or even tucked into shorts and some Converse and I thought that would be really cute so this was $2.99 um, really good again not really much to say but I'm going definitely with brighter colors and I'm like noticing that and as I go through them and I'm kind of like dude what were you thinking but then I'm also like okay give it a try so yeah this was really cute really excited to see how this looks on Next thing that I purchased was just a simple cami it was it's just like a navy it's picking up way bluer on the um, camera but I just really have a collection of these things and it, they're just easy to throw on even under this it's like you could just have it under just for an extra layer and it was 149 whenever you find a cami and it's like in a good condition and and you like it and you love the lace I advise to just purchase it because they're just a simple easy outfit to dress up or down so yeah I really like this it was super cute next thing that I got was petite sophisticated and it was $2.99 but it's just like this um it's a hundred percent wool so I have to be careful on how I wash it because I always ruin wool it just has little colorful flowers stitched inside of it and I just thought it would be cute just to wear with mom jeans so yeah I saw it on the try on rack to get put back and I was like ooh who would let this go it's actually kind of cute so but then again they got to try it on and I didn't so we'll see um, so yeah, I thought it was really cute, super easy to just put on, and then with the newsboy cap, and it's like, you got an outfit, so really excited for that. The next thing that I got was this, um, Forever 21. I don't really like getting Forever 21 or H&M or any, like, fast fashion things like that, um, at the thrift store, but then it's like, where to better do it than the thrift store to actually, rather than purchase it. So I guess I got it and I thought that this was like a super cute turtleneck. Um, it has like an open, like a wide sleeve. So I thought that's going to be really cute with just some jeans or even like a skirt just tucked in. So yeah, I, I purchased this and it's actually in really good condition considering that it was Forever 21 and that it's at the thrift store. So, really liking that and that was $5.99 so it was a little bit more expensive but honestly I think that the material is super cool I like how stretchy it is and it's just like a easy like throw on um type of outfit so really excited about that second to last item again is just a black cami and it has I just really like how big the lace was so I just had to get it because I thought it was really nice I don't have a black cami either I have a lot of like cream color ones so I do want to add more black this one is a tank top as far as like just wearing it I think it's gonna be really cute and this was again 149 so it's not like I'm breaking the bank purchasing this item it's more so like let's give it a try and if it doesn't work out okay then just give it to someone else you know so I thought that that was really cool and it's really pretty and one thing too is when you are looking for camis to make sure that there isn't any holes on the lace because that's some of the issues that I that's some of the issues that I've seen with these um, camis so that's really cute the last and final thing that I purchased was these just boyfriend mom jeans. It's not a brand. They're just like a plain indigo color. And yeah, they don't have a brand. So, oh, Faded Glory. Some Faded Glory jeans. And these were $2.99. So I, the way that I try on jeans is like... If it looks, if it has that vintage look, then I'll go ahead and give them a try. 
and if they fit then they fit if they don't then um if they're too big then i'll just see how they look with the belt if they're too small I gotta get over it and just let them be and hopefully someone else will find them and love them as I would love them but I purchased like the mom jeans from PacSun and stuff and they always see the zipper and the buttons always seem to go sideways on me so I'm hoping with these jeans they won't go sideways and hopefully they're made a little bit better with better material and quality than like the Paxson jeans and stuff so we will see but I, I really just needed more jeans to wear because the jeans that I have they just weren't working out and they weren't really they weren't really combining to my body so yeah I hope with these ones they will look good so yeah that's everything that I got in this thrift haul I was planning on going again today but I just ended up saying, you know what, let me just record this video and then I could go another day. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys have any other thrift stores that you guys go to, please let me know. I really like to venture out of my little city and I like to go towards more um, LA area and OC area. So just let me know what thrift stores you guys are shopping at and I would love to maybe check out one of your guys' thrift stores and see if I could find anything there. Other than that, I hope you guys have a great day and thank you for watching. We'll check back in soon. Thanks. Bye.